Hi, welcome back to No Haircut in a Long Time. I'm Cody, and let's fuck. <laughs> no, let, sorry, that didn't come out right. Let's not, let's watch people fuck. No, let's watch people get to the point where they're almost gonna fuck. I'm sorry, I'm this. I'm I'm gonna start over. Um, so there's like a handful of channels on YouTube these days that do the types of videos where they invite different types of people to a soundstage and then they do like some sort of social experiment or like play a game with them. You know, it's like Jubilee, Cut. They're cool. Like Jubilee does the one where people are in the same room and it's like they gotta figure out which one amongst themselves has an STD or something. <laughs> You know, like, I think Steve's got genital warts. I can feel it, he gives off that vibe. They're fun to watch, these videos. They just all end up looking exactly the same because like the formula's there and they're just like reproducing it with like different types of people and different games. Anyways, they do a lot of dating shows on these channels. Cut has been doing one of these, all right? Cut has that series that's like truth or drink. They have a couple like huge series on their channels. And I guess they've started this new one, it's a dating show. And it's called The Button or some shit? What's, what's it called? It's called The Button. Yes, The Button. And it's all, it's a show um, where dudes have to come up and they have to point out on a diagram where the clitoris is. <laughs> no, no, it's not that. <laughs> Basically, they sit at a table and they talk and if, they, if one of them doesn't want to go on a date with the other one, they press the button and they get a new date. It's basically like fucking Tinder and X Factor combined. <laughs> no, it's like Tinder and Omegle. It's like Omegle in real life. I gotta give Cut credit because this series is so much fun to watch because it's so awkward. It's so like mean and awkward and uncomfortable that it's like you just, you have to, I, I have to watch it with you so that you, we all can share in the uncomfortableness. So that's what we're gonna do. Welcome to The Button. Let's jump in. Welcome to The Button, a speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap out their date for a new person. You have been eliminated. What's your name? Andrew. Andrew, Ella. Ella, nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. Do you guys like to party? Wow, Button, wasting no time at all. Holy shit, just starting at 60 miles an hour there. Do you guys like to party? <laughs> Do you do cocaine at all? She looks like she snorts ketamine. That's the button, by the way. I like to I, dance. Oh, you like to dance? What kind of dancing? All of it. All funk, of it? Funk music's good. Oh, shit. Sorry, Ella. <laughs> oh my god. Holy fuck. That was fast. Why did he time it so weird? What was that? I love to dance. <laughs> Uh, the little misdirection there. That's what that was. Yeah, I love to dance. Every type of what? What types of do you like to? Fuck you! <laughs> oh, it's so mean. Why did you do that, dude? Yeah, I love dancing. Here, this is my favorite move. <laughs> oh, what about what about a little what about a little Millie Rock, huh? <laughs> cool, cool. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Why did you eliminate her? Yeah, dude. Why did you? Just, it's a feeling. I just wasn't feeling it. Doing well. How are you? I'm good. What's your name? I'm Andrew. Andrew, Caitlin, nice to meet you. Caitlin, nice to meet you. What do you like to do for fun? I love to dance. I'm totally a self-proclaimed cat lady, so I spend a lot of time with my cats. I like to read. I cook a lot. Cats are dope. Sorry, Caitlin. <laughs> oh! oh! Get owned, cat lady. Oh, that sucks. I feel bad for her. This guy, this guy's brutal, dude. Why? What's with the saying a positive thing and then ending it. That's so ruthless, dude. Yeah, cats are dope. You're not dope. Yeah, I love cats. Why don't you go fucking hang out with them in your apartment alone? <laughs> cats are dope. Fuck you. <laughs> cats? Oh, I've heard they have nine lives. You have zero in this game. Man, I don't like this guy. I don't like him. I get, you know, it's, you just get that feeling. I don't like him. I don't trust him. Sorry, Caitlin. You've been eliminated. Why did you do that, Andrew? I just wasn't attracted to her. At least he's honest. Hi, how are you? Sheldon, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm Andrew. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Becca. Nice to meet you, Becca. What do you guys do for a living? Why did they give the button such a shitty voice. Why does it sound like that? Man, they should have auto-tuned it. Make it sound fucking sick. Just make it sound like Tory Lanez. It's just fucking 
What do you guys do for a living? Yeah! Where is the clitoris? I'm a bartender. I sell software. Software? Super cool. nerdy shit. Software, huh? Is it... Friction? No, I'm not gonna say it. I dig your tattoo. That's dope. Lots Thank of you. color. Got the flower of life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ask Andrew if he has an age preference. Do you have an age preference? Yeah. Probably 25 to 30. How old are you? I'm 40. 40! He's 40! Looking for a 25 year old! <laughs> Good luck, dude. Let's see what she thinks. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Get fucked, Andrew! Ha ha ha! Sorry, Andrew. A little taste of your own medicine, bro. Go sell some software, homie. <laughs> I'm 22. Okay. I'm 22. No offense, but I also like don't fall into your thing. You no, know that's I mean? cool. No, that's cool. Yeah. No, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah. No, that's cool. I just I didn't even like your tattoos, anyways. That's cool. Why did you eliminate him? Cause he's old. He's old. Ugh. This is so uncomfortable. Why did you eliminate him? Is it because he sucks major butt cheek? I also thought so. What if the button was super mean? You suck ass. You're going to die alone. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Pretty good. My name's Becca, what's your name? Wagan. Wagan? Yes. Cool. God, you pretty. Oh, oh thank God. you. What are your guys' deal breakers? Dude, I think the button should just start off. I like the party question. That's what I mean. You got to start off with a crazy one right off the bat, like a heated one, like super controversial. Like, do you think that God is dead? <laughs> They're like, what? <laughs> Republicans. Ah, that's interesting. I don't blame you. Are you registered to vote? No, I'm actually not from here. Oh, okay, well that yeah, makes you, sense. Yeah, you're good. Is that an Apple Watch? It's a, yeah, it's an Apple Watch. Is that an Apple Watch? What kind of a question? Oh, it it is an Apple Watch? Oh, gee. <laughs> <laughs> Apple Watch, man. Someone please tell me if there's a cool way to wear an Apple Watch. Please. I have one, I love it. It looks like shit. It really does. Is there a cool strap or something I can use? I just go from, you know, cool guy, cool hot alpha, to, oh, hot, yeah, let me, let me check the f fucking weather, you know? How much do you make? <laughs> now that's a question. Ooh, good question. How much do you make? Oh, shit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm not answering that. What? I'm not answering that either. <laughs> Who do you think makes more money? I'm a budget analyst. You, you make more money. I don't know. That sounds like a real adult job. Oh, yeah? yeah. It doesn't matter. What, what do you do? I'm a bartender. That's what's up. Mm. That's what's up. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? It was going so well. Why did you do that, Brittany? Or whatever your name was? Was it the budget analyst shit? I don't understand. He's That means he's good with numbers. 69? Huh? I'm eight years old? He's probably got some bread, too. I mean, he's rock he's rocking an Apple Watch for God's sake. Man, this game is cold. I don't think I don't think my self esteem could handle this. Why did you do that? I don't know. He was cool, and I like talking to him. But like, I just know not really my type. Hi, I'm Nick. What's your name? I'm Becca. Nice Becca, to meet, nice you. meet you. How are you? I'm fantastic. How are you doing? Good. Why you... shouldn't someone be? Shut, shut up. <gasps> listen, listen to her. What do you What do you say? Um. I don't remember. <laughs> I, 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 How dare you? Shut up. You're really controlling the butt. It's interrupting. It's rude. What yeah. are you saying? Uh, Sim. <laughs> we got a white knight here, folks. <laughs> Shut up, button. This lovely woman is speaking. I'm sorry, my queen. What were you saying? <laughs> Weird. Weird way to start, for sure. It's interrupting. It's rude. What yeah. are you saying? Um, I don't, well, it's kind of, it's giving you prompts and now I don't remember what I was saying. I, this I is awkward. Yeah, I'm doing my saying. best. This is really hard. Yeah, it is, Button. I agree with you on that. Um, what are some of your turnoffs? Like instantly, like, no. If a girl drinks like plastic water bottles, like the non-reusable ones. <laughs> what? What? You can see on her face, she's like, oh, uh, what? How about like bad breath? That's a pretty classic turnoff. <laughs> Imagine this dude going back to a girl's place like after a night out to hook up 
and in like the middle of it he looks up and sees a, like a Dasani bottle sitting on her nightstand and he's like you know what I got a dip you're really not who I thought you were <laughs> honestly you have horrible body odor you smell like shit but I was gonna let that slide and then I saw the fucking Dasani bottle I'm out. Wait, is that a can in the garbage instead of the recycling? You know what, bitch? I'm out. Throw it in the compost. Any food waste like watermelon rinds. Why shouldn't someone date you? I think he just gave a pretty good reason, but see what he says. Why shouldn't someone date me? Yeah. I mean, I have a lot of Legos like at my house. Tell me more. About Legos? <laughs> a little like plastic building. <laughs> <laughs> he got her there. <laughs> Tell me more about those. What are Legos? The little plastic building blocks. You idiot. No, I know what they are, but why do you have them? Because <laughs> they're fun. You can just like buy a set and put it together and then you have like a TIE fighter or some shit. Like, a what? Oh, 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 button turned red. He's just, he's just digging this hole. He's just making it deeper and deeper. <laughs> Legos, that's, that's fine. You could probably still get away with that, right? Yeah, I like building Legos. That's fine. Some girls, girls will be like, okay. You know, you're not eight, but like, that's fine. People have hobbies. But then he was like, yeah, you could have your own TIE fighter. And she's like, okay, oh, what's, the, what's that? You watch Star Wars? Nah, fam. The Mandalorian takes place like chronologically after Yoda's death in the Star Wars. Oh, dude, pump the brakes. Look, there's nothing, there's nothing wrong with Legos or Star Wars or liking those things. It's just ease into it. You know, you're on a first date. Dude, you're supposed to lie about who you are <laughs> until the other person is deceived into liking you. Everybody knows that. That's how a first date works. You're not supposed to just jump right into the fucking deep end with Star Wars and talking about the timeline of where the Mandalorian fits in in the Star Wars franchise. She's gonna smash that button. Look, you got a hipster fit going on. You got some cannons on you, dude. You got some good biceps. All you had to do is not talk about fucking Mandalorian. <laughs> and this would have worked out. And you fucked it! Just, you should have just said, oh yeah, I love playing guitar. Oh yeah, I love writing poetry. You would have, you would have won! After Yoda's death in the Star Wars timeline. I can see her drying up. Watch this. No worries. I think you just know hey, so much no about worries. it. It's nice to meet you. No worries, I have my Legos at home, so. No worries, I have my TIE Fighters at home and they will never cheat on me. It's just kind of nerdy, I don't know. I mean, I guess it's not a deal breaker if you like know a lot about Star Wars, but like, you look like such a bitch. Hi. So you're the one on the streak, huh? I'm not you're trying, the trying the to Nah, be... no, I'm just playing with you. Oh, what's your name? Kane. what's yours? Hi, Kane. I'm Becca. Becca, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Kane is a stoner. I am a stoner. Oh, yeah, I'll smoke weed. Oh, fuck yeah. I pretty much only smoke indica. Sativa kind of freaks me out a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah totally, right. totally, yeah, yeah. Out, yeah. You know? Yeah, totally, totally. Indica. Yeah, just mellow, you know? More of like a body high. <laughs> Is this what stoner dates are like? <laughs> when two stoners go out? Yeah, yeah, what is your favorite strain? Yeah, same. Yeah, it just mellows me out. You ever have T-Rex arms? That's a good one. You ever roll up any pig's blood? Oh my God, I took a big rip of some nipple tassel the other day. Shit was mellow. What was that? What was what? Did no. you guys do something with your hands? Yeah, we fist bumped. <laughs> Can I receive a fist bump? Um, yeah. Oh, oh shut up, Button. Shut up. I get that you're you're this quirky little thing that's trying to ease the tension or whatever, but you're making it worse for me. You are. Can I get a fist bump? Oh. Wow. <laughs> so does every woman, unfortunately, but don't let that get you down, Kane. You are a king in my eyes. I do. Oh, I'm definitely not that, but I'm sure you noticed when I walked in. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, no. Okay, that one hurt. That one hurt. Okay, not only was that a diss on my man, Kane the Stoner, but that was also a diss on all short kings. And as a short king representative, I gotta say that uh, I don't, that your pineapple tattoo sucks. So, suck on that. Someone's gotta come out here and press the button on her before she even says a fucking word. Just hot. <coughs> What's up? That was for Kane. Kane's like, Oh, thanks, bro. You want to smoke a spliff? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make fun of one of my own. I feel bad about that. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I was really hoping that you would hit me. <laughs>
Why did you touch me? Like, I don't know, I feel like I could crush it. He's little and like, I don't know, I just wasn't my type. He wasn't my type. I feel really- Yeah, but he's got a big personality though. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> really bad hitting the button. It's making me feel so bad. He could smoke you under the table though, for sure. I know that about my man Kane. He can smoke some weed. Hi, I'm Chris. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name is- Oh, come on, come on. It's over. It's over. Look at this fucking guy. Are you kidding me? He's like six foot five. He's got the gold chain. Come, it's over. Nice to meet you, Becca. How are you doing today? Uh, I'm good. How old are you guys? I'm 22. I'm 26. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Ah! Justice. <laughs> Why did you eliminate her? She was too young. You get some years put on your life, 23 to 26. <laughs> you know what? Actually, I agree with that. Hi, I'm Hi. Chris. <laughs> I'm Jess. Jess, nice, <laughs> nice to meet you. you. <laughs> How long have you been sitting back there? Um, I feel like kind of like forever. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I'm sorry, I'm like, oh. oh, God. Oh, you didn't even get a chance. <laughs> I'm gonna hit it. I'm sorry. You have been eliminated. God, I feel like a dick. Why did you eliminate her? I could already tell we weren't gonna work out, but man, that does not feel good. I'm Chris. I'm Hazel. Hazel, nice, nice to meet to you. Nice to meet you. Oh gosh. Ready? Uh, no. 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 <laughs> Maybe. I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty easy, I think. I don't know. Were you nervous back there? I was a little nervous. It's weird. Yeah. Oh, this is so uncomfortable, but the, the like spy music in the background just makes it even worse. Do 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 do. What's he gonna do? Um. I'm sorry, I'm gonna. It's okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry for for. I'm sorry too. For some reason. <laughs> you have been eliminated. Why did you eliminate her? Um, she just wasn't my type. Wow. Um, not sure I like this. Why? I just feel so bad. It's not often that guys have to like reject girls. A girl's gotta do it all the time. Whoa. Holy shiz. Did I just smoke some indica? <laughs> Fuck, dude, we live in a society. He said the thing about 23 to 26, but this dude is wise beyond his years. It's a weird world we live in. Hello, I'm Emma. Emma, it's nice, nice to, to meet you, you Emma. Yeah, are yeah. you from Seattle? I'm actually from Maine. From Maine? Yes. That's, what? Yeah, <laughs> I road tripped out here this summer. Oh, and nice. Yeah, I'm working out here. Oh, nice, yeah. just cause. Yeah, never been Joe. to the West Coast. That's a fucking long road trip. Was it worth it so it far? It was so worth it, yeah. yeah. What Took is your type? Shut up, Button. They were vibing. They were quite clearly vibing and you would fuck it all up. Damn, all the way from Maine, that must have been a sick road trip. Yeah, it was crazy. Babe. What is your type? Shut up, you robot bitch. What's your type? <laughs> um, definitely brunettes and brown eyes. What about you? Tall, dark, and handsome. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, sick, so like me. <laughs> they just fucking explained each other to a T. <laughs> What's your type? Brunette, brown eyes, striped shirt, black t-shirt over top, chains, came from Maine, ring a bell. Let's bone. Okay, you mine, guys sure. described each other. Yeah, I just fucking said that button, all right? Try to keep up. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Chris enjoys old Disney movies. Well, I mean, that's just like what I grew up with. So maybe it's nostalgia, but you know, keeps me a kid at heart. Mm -hmm. um, How many people have you slept with, Chris? Oh my God, Button! Oh, Button. Button, you dirty, dirty bitch. What are you trying to cock block him now? What are you doing? Whose side are you on? They're, I said it before, but they are vibing. And he's like, Chris likes to jerk off to Disney movies. He's weird as fuck. <laughs> Chris wants to jerk off in your bathroom. <laughs> I'm not gonna answer that question. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I'm gonna answer the question because I do wanna stay on this date. Okay, what's your guess? I'm gonna guess like, 30. Actually, he's wearing an Apple Watch, so like 25. It's like, fuck it, I'm gonna throw all, right. all my cards on the table. If you answer, I'll answer. It's around like 60. Okay. Damn, damn. <laughs> I thought he was gonna say six. <laughs> it's around like six, and then he looked at her face, and if she went like this, then he was like, D, 60, for sure. 70. Okay. 
give or take. Yes, I they want me to press the button. Yeah, I but know. I'm not going to. <laughs> okay. I don't really? judge people on really? that. Really? Okay. No. Oh my god. Oh. They're going straight to the bone zone. Bone Town population two. Train is leaving in a second from station 69. <laughs> Well, okay, now it's your turn, let's see. I think around like 20. Okay. Yeah. For sure. This is going pretty well. You two are cute together. Well, thank you. I think you're cute. I think you're super cute. It is going down, folks. He's like, well, do you want to be my 61st? You guys are going to make super hot babies. For sure. Chris works out. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> there we go. That's the wingman we were all waiting for. Chris has a huge dick. <laughs> Compliment each other more. <laughs> I'm a big like teeth person. Yeah. I love your teeth. A big teeth person? You got some big ones, let me tell you. Thank you. Yeah. You have nice teeth Thank too. Thank you. Will you go on a second date with each other? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my god, just fuck already. Just fuck already, okay? This is too cute. What if they just started hooking up on top of the button? What if that's how this ended? They're just like, uh, uh, and the button, <laughs> climbing on top of the button, the button's like, no, 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 make it stop. Please, please, no, no. All right, well, that's it. I guess the lesson here is that, I don't know, att attractive people win shit. <laughs> That's all I got from this. A little bit depressing, but I don't, I, what else am I supposed to take away? People judge people on on their appearance. That could be the lesson. Listen, guys, let me know who you would have chosen. And let me know what's your favorite strain of weed. Let me know if this would have ruined your self-esteem. Imagine if you could see a list of all the people that swipe left on you on Tinder. That would suck ass, right? That's basically what this is. Anyways, let's hope that their date went well. Let's hope that they boned. Um, let's hope that they use protection and I hope that you use protection when it comes to your network. Today's video is sponsored by ExpressVPN. Now you may be wondering, Cody, <laughs> what is a VPN? Is that a weed smoking device? No, it's not. It's a virtual private network. Sending data on an unencrypted connection is like sending a postcard. It's, o it's out in the open for the mailman to snoop or for someone to read the sick shit that you're writing to your pen pal across the ocean. But when you use ExpressVPN, it protects you uh, from hackers or even your own internet service provider who doesn't need to know what websites you're visiting, what sick websites you're visiting. Plus you can use it to gain access to all the uh, restricted content that you don't normally get in your country. Like Harry Potter is available in Canadian Netflix. I use VPNs all the time to uh, make sure that my connection is secure and make sure nobody's snooping my data. And I think you should too. And you can find out how to get three months free by clicking the link in the description or going to expressvpn.com slash CodyCo. So, you know, throw on that protection. Don't surf the internet bareback. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace!